down. I'm gonna make sure these bastards remember my fucking Outstanding. Greetings gamers, I'm Pemby66. Um, I just thought I'd put out this little helpful tutorial for you guys. Especially you guys who like to stream movies from your PC to your PlayStation 3. And have found that the media player doesn't stream all your content. You know, it's that amount of times I go to watch a film on my, on my PS3, stream from the PC. But yeah, the PS3 either won't play it because it's an incompatible file. Or... It won't find the file up at all you know I if you've ever had that problem now I want to let you in on a oh, hang on a minute skills on to campaign walkthrough that's what I'm currently uploading it's in the processing stage right now so look and you can watch that if you've watched all five parts up to now you can watch that one and enjoy it but what I'm gonna do I've already got it saved this this is the website www.ps3mediaserver.org I click on there and there we go All right and this is it I've already downloaded it for Windows uh, download for the, your Apple for your Mac you know whatever um, and Linux as well now what this program does is, is it, it streams you, you, your content basically to your PlayStation 3 just like the media play does All right so you um, you go to the plugins actually no you just highlight the first one that's the latest one Click, go th follow the instructions and download it. All right. Now I'll show you what, what what it entails. I've got it running in the background. Right click. You, once you start the program up, um, you you'll have a you'll have it on your screen here. But once you minimise it, you, you know you you've only got this option. You just click on it. Right click, main panel, and this is what you get. Status. Now when you first start the program you won't have that tick it will eventually if it's everything's hunky dory and all your internet connections are, are, are fine then it will show you this tick as it, at the bottom it sees it says uh, detected media renderers playstation 3 in your windows media player um but in order to share your content and i mean all your content from your playstation 3 i'm uh, sorry from your pc to your playstation 3 you have to click on this button here Ignore, ignore all this. I don't bother with that. I mean, you can go into it if you want to, if you're really technically minded. But there's no, no real need. But all you do is click on this plus arrow here and add the particular vo folder that's got all your videos and films and whatnot, music, you know, pictures, whatever. If you want to share it to your PlayStation 3, it's particularly if you want to sit down and watch a movie and you're finding the media player for some reason, it's not, you know, doing what it should do. So I'll give you an example. Let's start with my record central to show us just as base. This is just basically to show you, the, you know, the the uh, PlayStation screen because I've got it on right now. So it's just to demonstrate to you guys, I'll, sh I'll sh give you a typical example of what I'm talking about and why I was looking for an alternative. It's running slowly because there's a lot going on on my PC right now, as you can see. With Sony Vegas is rendering. Um, a Killzone 2 campaign video. I've nearly finished that, by the way. I finished doing the parts of it, but I've not finished the editing. But let's just go into this. Come on, sometime today. Right now, you can see uh, Windows Media Player. I'll give you a typical example. I want to watch a, a gaming video that I've recorded with my Ava Media and me. View HD split. I mean, you got to record in HDMI. There's no other way to go, you know. But anyway, it's not about that. But if I press on that, videos, folders, desktop, Ava Media, two measly little folders, Beachhead and Wasteland, which are two maps from Killzone 2 custom bot zone games. And I'm thinking, well, where's the others? And I got that fed up with it. This is why I downloaded this program. There it is. There. PS3 media server. Now watch this. Desktop. Ava Media. Oh dear. There's more than two f files in there, isn't there? You know, two parts for me uh, kills on two walkthrough. And there's the, the, the missing Sulieva map, which I knew was in there. So basically, oh, I'll give you another example. 
I go to videos, folders, videos. I've got this film stored on my PC. Sometime today. I've got Carrie, the new film. That's a new new film. That, uh, where is it? See? Now, I'm looking for the film Pacific Rim. Right? It won't find it because it's incompatible. Because it doesn't encode it or anything like that. If you've got an MKV file or something like that, it won't... You, see, it just won't find it. I've still got my, 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 my only... My, my actual copy of the Fight Night Champion match I had recently with AC Carnage because it's such a good good fight, you know. I've kept my own copy. Um, as you can see, it only finds certain things. Now, if I go to that same folder but with this media server, watch what happens. Pacific Rim, there it is. Now, I can't, I can't really play it, but you can see it's about to start. I'll watch this. It will actually play it eventually. See? There we go. Now I can't play any more than that because I'll get done for copyright. So the, nobody can really. I mean, I hope I don't get in trouble for that anyway. But at the end of the day, it was only a split second, but it just shows you that it plays the film. Right? And it's the PlayStation 3 is not supposed to play MKV v files. But there you go. So check out this media server. I've, I've just shown you the, um, the web address. And if you're struggling getting all your content to play through your regular media player, then try this one. It's a fantastic alternative. And uh, if any problems, just let me know and uh, I'll try and help you out. You know, because I've had my fair share of problems and sometimes it won't find anything. But you get that with streaming. Depend on what your computer's doing at the time. If it's uploading, like mine's been uploading a, a video, you know, it's, it's all to do with bandwidth, I think. But anyway, I'm Pemby66. Check this media server out if you ever have any problems with the regular Windows media player server sort of thing. And, uh, you know, you can sit back and watch any content you want that you've got stored on your, your PC. Anyway, guys, thanks for watching. I'll catch you later. Thank you.